Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to connect to MongoDB database using Java. So before we do that, make sure that you have MongoDB server running so that our Java driver can connect to it. Okay. Also, make sure that you download Mongo Java driver. So simply Google Mongo Java driver and you will be redirected to this GitHub page. From here you can go to releases and find out how to download that jar file okay once you download that jar file note the location where you extracted that jar file then open Eclipse go to file menu click on new Java project here you can type your project name as Mongo demo then click on next here for libraries choose add external jars then point to mongo java driver that you just download click on open then click on finish okay now right click on your project then click on new then choose class here you simply check mongo demo okay then choose public static void main and hit finish okay it will generate this default class here okay so now type in mongo client mongo client equals to new mongo client here we specify localhost and we also specify the port which is 27017 okay next thing choose db db equals to mongo client dot get db okay so this is the database you can choose the test database or you can choose any specific from your mongodb for example here you just check show dbs and you get to see the set of databases okay you can choose mydb mydemo depending on if it is installed on your mongodb okay now the next thing to do is print out information that connection is successful okay so now that we are doing this you better want to add this in try and catch block you choose the exception okay then go for throws exception okay now next thing we will check which driver we need for db okay so simply import from com mongodb so you have two classes that needs to be here which is com mongodb db and mongodb mongo client and then just check if you have any errors or so okay so this should be fine Okay, now all you have to do is simply type out and here you can print the message. So uh, it's ready. 
okay you can give any other message depending on how you want your program to have that okay for this tutorial i just want to connect to database and then in later tutorials we will see how to add your data into collection update it and delete it okay so let's just first test how to connect to database so now go to run and it will show you connected to database server is ready okay if you are seeing this because within try method it will check for that host connection check database and if it has any issues it will throw the error but there were no errors so it, it printed this message so if there are any errors you will get exception okay so in next tutorial we will see how to add your data into collection then after that how to update it and finally delete it so i hope you find this video helpful pause the video go through the code and see how to do it on your own